morning. This is Arnie Waters here at Waters Capital in Boston, Massachusetts. I hope you had a great holiday weekend. Looking forward to a terrific year of trading in 2012. Our key focus right now is on gold. We see gold being in a difficult place for the next two or three weeks until things settle out. And the amount of gold buying in East India from the January holiday can be perceived. Uh, we're also uh, looking closely to see how much Chinese buying there is, given the political difficulties there are inside China. So we think it's early days to accumulate gold, but we're certainly not selling any. We have some trading ideas uh, that are not really for the folks at home, uh, but if you're a professional and you want some thoughts uh, from us for trading for this week, we're glad to share them. I can be reached on 781-380-8888. Uh, the other factor which we are looking at is how uh, there is a divergence appearing in the world, eco world economic situation. We see that the Europeans are going down rapidly and the U.S. having stabilized is tentatively moving slightly forward. There will be some plus U.S. GDP this year. I'm not sure unemployment is going to go down. Um, but I do believe the U.S. GDP is going to continue to trend in a very weak way, one and a half, one and a quarter, one and three quarter kind of percent rate. We also expect that the presidential election will preclude any major economic undertakings that will address the uh, unemployment situation, the public work situation in the United States. Uh, we remain optimistic that Barack Obama will get a second term. Uh, we find that the uh, difficulties the Republicans have uh, selecting between a Mormon and a Catholic are quite sad and reflective of the bigotry which characterizes a great deal of the Republican Party. Oddly enough, it was the Republicans, of course, under Abraham Lincoln, who uh, led the cessation and abolition of slavery. Quite interesting how things change over 100 plus years. Well, this is Arnie Waters. I'm encouraging you to aim for the ice flows, not the open water. Don't sell any gold, uh, but it's not quite the time to load up as yet. We have a very optimistic view. We're looking for uh, the gold to rise seven or eight hundred dollars over the course of this year. Uh, we think a lot of that's going to begin in the first quarter, so that's why we're encouraging you to hold on to positions rather than to liquidate them. Have a great day. Be good to those who love you, and be sweet to those who don't. Have a nice day.